What's going on guys, it's Kingdom and I'm going to be showing you every tip and secret to the skateboards that I've found since getting the game on the first day. If you do find this video to be helpful, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for future tips and good 2k videos. Let's get into it. So real quick for the people that don't know how to get the skateboard, you don't have to actually go to any store to get the board, literally all you have to do is hold the left bumper and move the right stick to the top left direction of the panel and select the skateboard. Now, the first tip that I have actually has nothing to do with the skateboard itself. The skateboard is definitely faster than running around, but when you hit All Star 1, you can just set your spawn point to go from spawn point to spawn point across the entire map instantly, rather than skateboarding for a few minutes to go across the whole map. I made an entire video about this fast travel method, so if you're watching this, then I highly suggest you watch that video after. It's going to save you a lot more time than you think, and if you don't know about it already, then you're missing out. My second tip is something I found myself doing a lot more than I thought. When you go over a curve or anything like that, it automatically does an ollie for you, but if you pull back on the left stick as you go over the curb, you'll just go right over it instead of doing some exaggerated 36 inch ollie over a 2 inch curb. My third tip is something that's pretty well known at this point, and that's the speed glitch or method, whatever you want to call it. Doing this method will almost double the speed of your skateboard. It's actually really simple if you don't know. Instead of just holding down the right trigger to go faster on the skateboard, you actually just tap the right trigger on like a certain pattern to go faster. You just have to tap it every time your right foot starts to reach the starting position again. It's about every half second if you can attempt to time that in your head somehow. Here you can clearly tell the difference between doing the method and just holding the right trigger down. It's really not even close. It takes half the time to get going at a faster full speed than it does just to hold it down and get going that way. My next tip is something that I only use in certain situations, but it does become useful and I didn't even know you could do it until a friend told me. When you pull back on the left stick when you're at a complete stop, you'll do this little turnaround animation while staying in the same spot instead of having to pick up speed and do a huge circle just to turn around. As I mentioned earlier, you don't have to go to Dex first to get the skateboard, but if you do go to Dex and get a skateboard, just know you're spending over 30,000 VC on a skateboard that goes the exact same speed as everybody else's free skateboard. Speaking of spending a ridiculous amount of VC on something that gives you no benefit whatsoever, that brings me to the options of transportation that aren't the skateboard. I'm talking specifically about the bikes and the scooters. They all go about the same speed, and I know for sure that the bike is the same speed, if not slower than the skateboard. I'm not sure about the scooter, but I think it's the exact same speed as the skateboard as well. The only one that goes faster than the skateboard is the hoverboard, but you gotta hit Elite 2 and drop $50 for a virtual hoverboard. Well that's all my tips, so that about wraps up the video. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like and consider subscribing. I upload multiple times a week and have all different types of videos coming. But other than that, I'm out.